I recently caught up with Juliet Economo, who's the Director of Commercial Services for Roads and Maritimes. I really love talking to Juliet. There are so many moments, like the one you're about to see here, when we start talking about building resilience. And she pulls the golden thread through all the things that are important in regards to discipline, learning, building good practices, and she relates it to work and her kids. She discusses grat gratitude. So let's hear Julia explain. It's a great question. Yeah, it's hard. Right. Isn't it? Yeah, like I, so I'm constantly looking at how I can do yeah, that yeah, with my kids. Yeah, yeah. Because gosh, do they need some resilience. You know, doing what you do from an inspirational point of view and you know, getting up every day and fitting everything in. I mean, that is huge. It's in hard, itself, it's hard isn't work. It? And, and, um, and just but then for them to see it though, and well, for yeah. them, that to be their norm, and for that to be... And that's the thing, yeah, you know, having yeah. to constantly say to them, you know what, this didn't, this didn't happen by accident. Like, yeah. it's, a, it's a lot of hard work, and it's this stuff that happens, you know, late at night, I'm reading and um, doing stuff, trying to learn constantly. Um, yeah. And everything starts at a young age. You've got to get to those, you know, really good habits early in order yeah. to to foster that that discipline, really. Yeah. Um, so it's it's a it's a tough one, I think, to, to teach our kids because especially at the at the moment, kids are used to getting everything so quickly. It's yes. just you know, a swipe of an iPhone or whatever no. it is. It's just oh, it's yeah, frustrating. Yeah. Um, but you know, we've got to teach them that that um, hard work is yeah. is um, integral yeah. to success. It's even like we were talking earlier, and I love the fact that you used the word discipline. And you were saying about your daughter um, singing in the choir tonight. Yeah. Because actually, whether it is singing or dancing, you know, it's, I mean, I don't know the percent, but it must be like 90% of the time you're practicing, training, practicing, training, yeah. practicing, and then you do one show or one exam a year. That's it. That's, that's discipline, isn't it? It that's, is. Yeah, Absolutely. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 yeah, which in work, you know, I'm sure... I'm sure when you won the award, um, you know, it wasn't, you didn't do everything to win the award. It was the discipline, the hard work, the discipline, to, and that's what it resulted in. That's but, it. Yeah, yeah. 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 That's it. Yeah. And also just simple things, you know, um, being able to show your kids, um, you know, the results of the hard work and everything that we do, it culminates in, you know, us having the lifestyle that we have. Yeah. And to be grateful for what you have, because there are people out there who have so much less and yes. who are really going through some hard times. Yeah. So we're really lucky to be in the, in the position that we're in and yeah. just very privileged, actually, to be in this amazing country, you yes. know, with um, an economy that operates the way it does yeah. um, and the opportunities that we have. You know, there's, there's people out there who just... We never get that, no. never get those chances. But you've got to be able to every now and then just stop. Yeah. You know, stop and smell the roses. Actually yeah. appreciate what, what you've got. Yes. Um, appreciate what all the hard work that you've put in so far is, is bringing you and your family and your yeah. friends. Um, and, then, and then, you know, keep going. Yeah, that's brilliant advice because otherwise you're constantly you always want more. Yeah. The yeah, more you yeah. have, the more you want. Yeah, that's the, yeah. that's the, the terrible thing. Yeah, yeah, true. What I love about Juliet's leadership style is how grounded it is and totally unembellished. It's very clear to me, and I hope it has come across to you, um, that her brand of leadership is akin to being a steward of people's career or a custodian of their well-being. And that is absolutely what this leadership series is all about. So thank you, Juliet. Mm -hmm.